everyone and welcome to day eight of our <laughs> hi Lumos of our 21 day challenge uh it's going great so far i'm 11 life living life I don't, I don't know what's going on i don't know what i'm saying but it's fine day day eight day number eight i just finished uploading day seven and i just published it so if you haven't go check that one out all go check that one out already go check that one out if you haven't seen it already go check it out it's a day, I don't, I can't do English. So I just uploaded that one, so please go check it out. That's what I'm trying to say, there we go, it's done. Um, but today is going to be, I, I don't know what today's gonna be. Um, I just made breakfast, and it's 10.21, and I got up pretty early, seeing, which is weird, seeing as I went to bed very, very late. I just woke up, I'm like, mm, I'm not tired anymore. So I think the B12's working, um, but right now it is currently like raining and it could snow and by it could snow it probably definitely not because it's florida but like it's gloomy and rainy and really cold so when i was in like high school and middle school um when the twilight books were really popular me and my sister read them so we'd call days like this a forks day because like that's what forks would be like every day i don't know <laughs> twilight man <laughs> today i'm actually going to be heading over to my parents house they live about two hours away um so i'm going to be heading over there to spend uh the rest of today and then tomorrow with them because I haven't been able to see them during the holiday season because I've had work and they left for Christmas so that's gonna be happening I don't know what we have planned I know they have work so I'll probably it's just probably just be a lot of me chilling which is exactly what I need so I'm I'm hype I'm excited to see them um, but for right now I made a smoothie bowl so let me show you so this is what we have right now ignore the fact that it's like sitting on my bed and that's slightly gross but also I don't care um, just my regular smoothie. So this time instead of spinach, I put in just like mixed greens because that was all I had. And so it's a little bit bitter um, because there's like arugula in it, but it's okay. Um, and then mixed tropical fruit, some mixed berries for the color, chia seeds, and oh, there's a banana in there too, and some crunchy peanut butter. So I'm gonna eat this up because it looks really, really good and I'm hungry. And then after I'm done doing eating this, um, I'm gonna hang out a little bit and then I need to put my laundry back in the jar because it's been sitting there too long and now it's all wrinkled, so I need to redo it. And then I'm gonna go to the gym for a little bit before I leave and I need to just clean up my room and things. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna leave Lumos here or not because I'm not gonna be gone, like I'm leaving later today and then I'm coming back tomorrow. So he should be okay. Um, so I'm still deciding. I'm probably gonna leave him. It, it's really, I'm not gonna be gone long at all. As long as, they say you can leave your bunnies as long as it's not like, it, it can be overnight, but no longer than like two nights type of deal. So yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. But right now I'm gonna eat my smoothie bowl and stop talking. We just look at this bun right now. He looks so cute. Little moist. Little moist. He was just like, he's, up a little bit more now, but he was passed out a few minutes ago. He's so cute. Gosh. You guys, this weather has been giving me absolutely no motivation to do anything. It's still rainy and dreary outside, which I love if I'm just sitting in my bed doing nothing. But I need to be productive because I need to drive to Tampa and that takes two hours and I want to get there um, fairly soonish because I, we're going to go out and have dinner and stuff. So my parents are going to be back at like five. So I want to be there like when they get home from work type of deal um but right now it's 12 18 and i have done nothing at all so what i need to do now i think i'm gonna go to the gym for like half an hour and just get in some cardio just go on the treadmill or something for like half an hour and then um while that's happening i'm gonna put my laundry in the dryer so that or re redo it and it's like where's the, the lighting area um just like re do it because it's all wrinkly now and then when I get back from the gym then it will be de wrinkled but before I do all that I need to clean up my room so that when I come back all I really need to do all I really need to do is pack take a shower clean Lumos oh god I have a lot to do okay I'm gonna stop talking and just do it because oh god <laughs> I would just quickly like to announce how pathetic I am um I am so cold it's freezing outside guys and it's Florida but it's literally snowing um oh where what city like i think it's a couple hours up it's it's pretty in the north like it's i think tallahassee was what it was um but it's snowing in florida so it's cold here folks it's cold but i am donned up in my little beanie i got my booth bay harbor maine sweatshirt if you know where that is well it's in maine but if you've like been there let me know because i love it i love talking about maine um and i also put on my sweatpants and some converse so this is my otd it's cute this is my driving day outfit and i still haven't left guys it's literally almost three o'clock and i haven't done anything although 
in my defense, I did do my laundry and I got that all folded and everything and I cleaned my room and I cleaned Lewis' stuff and I prepped him. Um, I did not go to the gym, however, because I was <laughs> like deciding if I wanted to go or not and then I got really bad cramps as I was deciding. And then I was like, no, no, not today. And I've heard that exercise is good for cramps and I th I'm pretty sure I've tried it before and I'm pretty sure it didn't work. So. If anything, I might do like a workout at my parents' house, but today also might be a rest day. Um, and I know I wanted to do 21 days straight going to the gym, but that's not always feasible. So I think if I take today off, it's not going to be a bad thing. Um, but I do want to try and do something when I'm there. Maybe we'll go for like a walk outside or something. That would be, that would be nice. Um, so yes, I'm going to leave now. Lumos has got all of his stuff prepped. So I am going to leave him because it is 3 o'clock and I'm going to be back tomorrow anyway, so it's not that long of a time. He's got two bowls of water here. He's got enough hay to last him decades. There's so much in here. Um, and his litter box is just cleaned. And then everything else is pretty much rabbit-proofed, so we should be good. And he's usually pretty, pretty good when I'm gone. All left I need to do is finish packing. So I need to put this jacket into my backpack. And then I need to put my laptop into my backpack. And then, should, should be good. And then I need to grab some food stuff because my parents don't, are not vegan. Um, nor do they have common foods like bananas. Like, they they do sometimes, but I usually have to bring my own bananas because I eat, I eat at least one banana a day, at least. And they never have enough to, uh, <laughs> to go with that. So I'm gonna pack some food and I also have some Chipotle left over from last night that I'm gonna bring with me in the car to eat because I'm not sure if I'm because I feel kind of hungry but I also don't feel hungry and I think the not feeling hungry thing is from the cramps so I should probably try and eat something because the only thing I've had today is a smoothie and that was at like 10 o'clock so I should probably eat something um, but I, we're, we're gonna go okay all right Lumos I'll see you later boo I'll see you later honey look at the sweet little face hi honey I'll see you later. I see you tomorrow. You can you can be good while I'm gone. Yeah. Yeah, you are. Oh goodness, he's so cute. All right, honey. I'll see you later. And with that, let us head to the car for our long journey to Tampa. It's not that far. It's like two hours away. Okay, y'all. This car ride is about to be lit. Let me just start. Um, I got all of my stuff all packed in my car. As you can see, not that much. I'm literally gonna be back tomorrow, so it's not even that big of a deal. But it's gonna be lit, because I have leftover Chipotle. I'm so excited to eat this. I'm um, gaining back my uh, <laughs> hunger, so that's nice. And it's also like just a, enough that I can get by for the next couple hours, but then we'll probably go out to eat, and hopefully they'll take us um, to a Thai place. There's a Thai place by my parents' house that we love to go to because um, everyone likes it and I can get tofu stuff there. So I'm all about it. So fingers crossed that's where we're gonna go today. We're gonna head off. Um, I'm gonna pull up some lore on my uh, on my phone so we can have some entertainment on the way. But let's head off to Tampa. Hey everyone. So if you are um, OG subscribers uh, from last year from Vlogmas, you will remember this, this background very well. Um, this is where I filmed a good majority of my Vlogmas videos, which was in this bed. Um, <laughs> Just hanging out watching what was I watching last year Gilmore Girls. That was the thing um, But yeah, so I'm back at my parents house. Um, it is 10 12 right now and I just got he I didn't just get here I got here kind of hung out with the parentals and stuff and hanging out mostly means we're on our Technologies like computers and phones. That's that's my family's way of bonding. So, you know what? Each family does it different, whatever. Um, but for dinner, I had um, a, like a butternut squash soup from Pacific that I'm not sure if I like it or not. Um, it's, it's sweet, which is normally how butternut squash is. So it's not the soup, it's just like the, the, the flavor of the soup. Like I like their tomato basil a lot, but I, I don't know if I love butternut squash soup in general. So I'm gonna have to try it again and see. But that was, that was okay, and then we still had an Amy's burrito left over from the last time I was here. So I had that, which didn't fit my gluten-free thing, but there was also nothing else for me to eat in the house. So, you know, you gotta settle. Cause we, we were gonna go out to eat, um, but we could not 
pick a pick a place to go to. Well, I could pick a place to go to, but they didn't want to go any places I wanted to go to. And then they're like, let's do Panera. And then I remember that Panera got rid of all of their vegan soups. And I'm like, I already have soup here. Like, so we just we just stayed. We just hung out. Um, but maybe they'll want to do something else tomorrow. We were gonna. They wanted to go to Moe's, but I already had Chipotle, and I'm like, I can't. I can't do that. So long story short, I had a burrito and soup for dinner. I don't know. It was just weird. And I hope they don't come out here and hear me talking about it. But coming back home, they were. My parents were talking about their their calorie counting now, and their. They. My dad literally asked. He's like, how many calories are in grilled cheese? And I'm like, that. Uh, like it hurts me like I can't and I'm like it doesn't doesn't matter like this doesn't matter Just eat healthy food you don't have to worry about it and a grilled cheese is not a, like like if you guys are trying to get healthy that's not the way to do it cutting calories is not the way to get healthy that's not how it works e eating better food is the way to get healthy but they don't get that so I I've been vegan for two and a half years so I've I've done my fair share of spieling but sometimes it just doesn't work and it you know, a lot of people with family members that aren't, and they're supportive-ish, but like a lot of people with family members that aren't supportive understand this and that like it's it's hard that you want to help, but you can't with some people, you can't. So, you know, you do what you, you, do, what you do, you lead by example, and that is sometimes all that you can do. Um, so, story time short, and sorry I sound stuffy, I'm all congested again, this is just, it's rough. We've trademarked it as the polar plague because everyone in the cast got sick um, after and during the show. Um, so I'm still recovering it from it, but it's gonna be good. Um, but yeah, I also decided to not exercise today. And by decided, I mean I just ended, ended up not. It's okay. It's okay. It's fine. I'm gonna go home uh, tomorrow and then hop on the treadmill uh, when I get back. I shouldn't be home too, too late, so that should be fine. Um, and then start my workout in but I also didn't really eat a lot today, so I don't think it matters much. I had a smoothie, half a Chipotle, and then a soup and a burrito. So I I think I'm okay. <laughs> it's it's not going to come into that exercise for one day. So I'm going to end the vlog here, though, so I can start editing it and just put it, put it all together for you all. Um, so I just want to say thanks so much for watching. This was day... Is day eight? Yeah, this is day eight. Wow. So thanks so much for watching day eight of my 21-day challenge, which... <laughs> And my challenge is supposed to be exercising every day, but it's okay, it's okay, just leave it be. 21 day challenge isn't vlogging every day, and then we're trying to figure out other things around it. We can't be perfect. We can strive for, for we strive for perfection, but if we don't accomplish it, then we land among the stars, right? That's how that works. I don't know. Uh, but anyways, I'm going to end the vlog here, and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. See ya. Bye. <laughs> It's a dream that's coming true